Hello everybody, today we have a lesson that's really quite simple once you get the gist of it. Now, the equation that we have so far, not the equation, but the numerical value that we have so far is 16 to the 3 halves. Well, how do we know the number that is 16 to the 3 halves? Well, it's really quite simple if you think about it. We have our numerator, or not, not, not our numerator, our denominator here, denominator, the power of our numerator, numerator. Sounds simple, right? Now let's implement it into our studies. So, using this, we know that we can do the square root of 16 taught with the overall, with the, the answer is going to be cubed, right? We know that the square root of 16 is 4. Now what we have here is 4 to the thirds. Well, what's 4 to the thirds? If you don't know automatically, don't feel bad. It's 4 times 4 times 4. 16 times 4, because we know that these two can become is 16 and we're, simp we're simply just simplifying it. And 16 times 4, yeah, that's 64. So our answer is going to be 64. Sounds simple, eh? Well, why don't you implement it into your own studies, into what you do in everyday life? You might not use this principle, but keep it in mind that denominator goes first, numerator goes last. See you in the next one.